Welcome to Nature Speaks, everyone. My name is Tracy, and this is today's message channeled from the spirits and energies of the natural world. Today, the great spirit of the Kingfisher steps forward with a gift and a blessing for us and some wisdom. And they actually, when I first began to channel them, they placed an image in my head and they go, can you please explain what you're, what you're perceiving within your mind's eye? And what I saw was a wall, like a, a riverbank, um, with little holes carved into the side of the, of the riverbank and little kingfisher birds sitting in them. And they go, those are our dwelling places. There were times in your um, history as a species where you understood the wisdom of placing your dwelling places within the earth. We would step forward to remind you of um, the benefits of doing something like this, which has and will offer those of your, um, your human family relief of the distress of being fully exposed to the increasing temperatures uh, of the rays of the sun as the climate continues to shift. When you place yourself and your dwelling places within the soils, and then I'm there showing me images of, I don't know, like mounds of earth with grass on top of them, and then you know, almost like a side of a hill, and then you can see that the doorway to come out is actually in the hill rather than at the top, uh, sitting on top of it. They go, you will find that this will benefit you greatly as it will mitigate the um, exposure to the ever increasing heat from the solar rays and also offer you that which is insulation from if you happen to be in a place that gets cold as well. This is something that we offer as a gift to you as we are aware of this will be hugely valuable to many 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 of you who live particularly those who are not able to access those artificial methods of heating and cooling that are so common in certain parts of your earth plane right now and they further offer that prudence is another gift that they offer us they go we would observe that if you consume all of the fruits of the tree in one season that it makes it rather more challenging for those who come after or for your own issue and uh, a much less pleasant experience of life when the available resources in total have been consumed or in great measure have been consumed. And so they're offering us the gift of prudence, not only in our consumption of what they would call the fossil fuels, they go, which are exacerbating these extreme conditions. They go, we would offer that it is useful to place, rather than to remove from what is in the breast of Gaia, that is the fossil fuels which are increasing these um, extreme weather conditions, but to place yourself within the breast of Gaia um, and in this way uh, reduce uh, the use in this manner of these things which are going to keep increasing these extremes and also offer you protection and mitigation from the extremes of temperature. And so these are the blessings that the great spirit of the Kingfisher has stepped forward to offer us and they further do observe, they go, we're not unaware that many of those aspects of the of the waterways of the rivers and the streams and the other places that we seek and find our nourishment um, you know in the ponds the rivers you know that they're drying up it's an existential threat to our species as well it's pretty much what they're saying and they go we will be very pleased and very grateful to know that the gift of our wisdom um, about placing yourselves and beginning to now, placing yourselves and creating shelters and environments that have and are within the earth. And they go, we find it quite beautiful to know ourselves as we rest against the breast of Gaia and feel the great love that she holds for us next to us as we rest there. They will be most grateful to know that they have contributed in some small way to that which would be assisting us 
in this great epic of shift for all life and flow here on this earth plane. That's the gift from the great spirit of the Kingfisher. And I just want to say I am so grateful for the light that I feel coming from each and all of you. If you are drawn to consume more than this short video summary, access to the full channeling of today's update is available on the Gaia Translate podcast, streaming now on your favorite podcast platform, or listen for free at www.gaiatranslate.com.